Hi there, proxies. <gasps> Welcome to the Zilla Zone Zero version 1.2 special program. Hello, please. Continuing from our last update featuring the demolition case that caused quite a stir. Oh, the yeah, just a little bit. Of our main <laughs> suspect, Pearlman, remain unknown. Let's go. Mr. Z. That he's fled to the outer ring. Is this and Mr. Z's so first time hosting? He's very cute. To you from the boundless outer ring, huh? Who am I? Well, I'm the intelligence broker with the hottest gossip mm -hmm. on the scene, Mr. Z. <clears throat> oh my goodness. You can see, this is a nose. The reaches of the outer ring play host to this update's new story, the Tour de Inferno. Tour de Inferno. I am sure you have all seen the Sons of Caledon mm -hmm. operate at the fringes of New Eridu. We have, we sure they do. They own a powerful logistics company by the name of Leaps and Bounds, which can okay. handle deliveries through hollows. I did not know that. A few of you proxies have already run into some of their team. Today, We've seen them around. We invited two new friends from the Sons of Caledon to join the program. Yo. Let's give a warm welcome to Caesar, Caesar and Bernice. Caesar and Bernice. Biker gang and Bernice. The master mixologist from the outer ring. Okay, but, so uh, Caesar's the young leader. They're still not here. They're late as mm -hmm. expected. <laughs> they don't follow your schedule. A lot into this program. Yeah, oh, I'm very happy to have like Ian voice to me to tell you on this program. Content in this version. So, Yippee! Here we are, I guess. Let's, Let's go. Get things started. We're ready First to go. Is... is this the place? <gasps> Where's Mr. Oh C? my goodness. Don't it's Caesar and late. Bernice. <laughs> I didn't realize huh? Bernice's name was spelled B-U-R-N, -E? like you burn. Are a little late, and I don't remember your interest being like that in the script. Hey, <laughs> our way is much cooler. Oh, her All voice right. is so nice. Why you're the most badass biker gang mean leaders in logistics in the Whoa. Why don't <laughs> yeah, totally not a biker system? gang. Hey there, I'm Caesar. <gasps> happy to be on the show today. I like hey, her voice as well. I'm Bernice. Oh, Bernice is so quirky. <laughs> We're gonna walk you through the new content in version 1.2. Oh, her voice is so animated. Thanks for showing It's like how's electricity. Now, without further ado, let's get started. Taylor. Here we go. Wow. This place looks amazing. Oh my goodness. This fits ZZZ's art style so well. Wow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is so cool. Y'all, this is so cool. This is a whole new step forward for ZZZ. <gasps> that is so cute. Oh my goodness. Time for a formal introduction. Whoa! The, of Caledon. <laughs> I'm the, current boss. the current boss? Do they change bosses frequently? Let's see Caesar's animations. Oh, she's kind of, she's kind of thick. Okay, she looks so cool. Here's Bernice. Let's go. I'm curious to see about her jetpack. I mean, indeed, applies fire. It appears. Oh, she looks so cool. Her legs. Ooh, wee. So good. Okay, I like Bernice. I think I like Warning. Bernice more. A significant increase in ether New story. New story. Cinderglow Lake has been detected. Who is this? <laughs> the weak and the worthless have no place in this age. With the power of Earth, I will establish a new order in this leaderless outer ring. A kingdom completely under my control. That enemy looks so cool. Oh my gosh. I'm supposed to be here. Wow, cool girls don't look at explosions. <laughs> wow. Bell, no, don't hurt Bell. That is so sick. It's so sick, dude. Two Odor Day Inferno looks so good. Looks incredible. For real, that was so good. The wide open wasteland of the outer ring actually has an underground side to it. And when it comes to this place, I'm sure you two are the experts. Could you please I'm sure they are, yeah. See some insight here. <laughs> mm -hmm. Tell us what you know. Leave it to me. The outer ring is what people It looks so cool. This camera angle the main urban looks kind of familiar. It's farther out than both Janus and Faunus quarters and closer to this desert wilderness. Which you don't get to see inside the city. 
Yeah, we're way outside way Eridu now. It looks totally different. <laughs> That's right. This was the fuel resource used during the old civilization. The old the civilization? Rain, Are they talking about me? Matter, but instead, rely on oil to sustain themselves. They just like me We're for real. Also selling some off to companies in New Eridu. America Even Simulator. Fell, folks came out here to start fresh, escape from old memories, and of course, some just want to hide from PubSec. It's Oops. not like in the city. <laughs> has people peppered around and supplies scattered about. So it's up to the biker gangs to get supplies to the locals. Biker gangs are highly trained. Oh, that art looks so good. So I bet, yeah, these are comic panels from the new story. For sure. If you want to survive out here, you'll need them. Wow. I bet that guy's the antagonist. The big enemy that we saw at the end. Of course. And among all the biker gangs, the sons of Caledon are the best around. Yeah! Wait, we are? Bernice, well, oh my gosh. <laughs> your logistics company, Leaps and Bounds, has certainly made a name for itself in the outer ring. Mm -hmm. After all, not everyone can handle the job of transporting supplies through high risk hollows. Yep. If you want a pro job done, then just leave it up to the pros. Yep. They got they it. Let's go. Oh, this looks so cool. Reason. Dude, do you think we're going to get to drive a motorcycle? This is like a huge. Adventure. Yes! No way! That's crazy! This is so freaking sick! Oh my goodness! Whoa! Whoa! Okay, Caesar. Caesar, character information. <laughs> I do think I prefer Bernice. <laughs> She's so spicy. Drinks operation. As for what kinds of drinks Bernice sells, well, we're not really at liberty to say right now. Oh no! <laughs> safe to say that her drinks are famous throughout the outer ring. <laughs> Plus, there's Piper and Lucy, who you've mm -hmm. already met. They're members of the gang too. That's mm -hmm. right. Piper is the best truck driver around these parts. <laughs> Lucy. She's our top supervisor. Sometimes I can confuse those two. She's always so competitive with Caesar for some reason. If you he probably to wants to be the leader. Proxies, you'll probably catch those two square and off. Oh, they're well, cute. Here's a friendly tip from a kind gentleman in sunglasses. Don't play referee and try not to get caught in the crossfire. Whoever could that be? Crossfire. <laughs> Don't listen to lighter's nonsense. Lighter. This is lighter. Okay. Of lighter, you'll be okay. He's in the we'll flesh. A pretty tough opponent this time around. Now Ooh, that you he looks so handsome. The sons of Caledon must have some serious competition in the outer ring, right? That's for sure. Even though we're all part of the Motor League, we're not exactly all on the same team. Biker gangs tend to cooperate and compete with each other at the same time out here. Take the Vanquisher. This looks for so example. cool. They're our biggest rivals. We sons of Caledon have got a score to settle with them. Oh yeah, time to settle the score. Oh my goodness! Card, Whoa! Did you see the cat, Leopard Woman? The oh, that was so cool. Speaking of Pompey, everyone in the Pompey. Okay, that's his name. Seen him for a while. He's the Nobody antagonist. He's been up to. Supposedly. <laughs> One day, he's gonna have to give up his position as Overlord. <laughs> Overlord, huh? Yeah. That's oh gosh, that looks cool. Yep, that's him. You know it. For sure. It's not the kind of title that just anyone in the outer ring can have. The oil industry runs the old oil field out here, and the whole shebang relies on support from the Motor League. The Overlord's the strongest among the biker gangs. As the head of the Motor League, the Overlord wields their power to... Uh, wields their power to... Hmm? Third time's the charm? Hey, didn't Lucy tell you to memorize all those lines like a thousand times <laughs> before coming here? She's like, it's fine. Anyways... The Overlord wields the power to designate transport routes as the boss of the Motor League, which is a huge boon. It's like super powerful, like a mixologist with a whole barrel of pure undiluted nitro fuel. That sounds pretty cool. Since every biker wants to be the Overlord, <laughs> we had to find a way to see who's the winner. So we came up the with the Bowl. Hollow Motor Race, the Tour d'Inferno. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's Sounds so cool. Like we can expect to see some real cutthroat and underhanded action. Oh, I'm so looking forward to this. 
Whoever wins or loses is decided fair and square. I heard there's a famous legend about the Torch Inferno in the Outer Ring. So, <gasps> Ooh, chapter four. Chapter four of the main story confirmed. Out. Chapter four of the main story confirmed. Ton of work to we will be there. We will be playing it all on day one. I am an intelligence broker. I've kept dossiers on you two for quite a while now. Oh, uh, yeah? <laughs> oh, this must be their character info. Oh, come on. What kind of characters are you? What do you do? Caesar King, the most badass rider in the outer ring. Defense? As a physical defense agent, adapt at using both sword and shield in combat. Let's go. When the what do you do? An attack, if Caesar successfully blocks it with her shield, it triggers a perfect block. Carry counter? The damage, That's her skill? With the next move of a special attack or EX special attack. Okay. She triggers a perfect block, defensive assist, or meets other certain requirements. She applies debuffs to surrounding enemies. Applies debuffs? Oh, okay. To them. Play oh, that's really cool. It can be a slick way to attack and debuff at the same time. That's correct. When Caesar is in combat, she can protect on-field squad members and boost their anti-interrupt level by providing a shield with her EX special attack. So she protects and buffs. Okay, let's go. Caesar swings her shield and charges into the battlefield in the Overlord's Grace Dance to damage the enemy. It kind of looks like it has grouping. I defense agent, but that's because it's what I'm best at. I still know how to make the pain rain. <laughs> that's cool. That's Caesar for you. She can take a hit and strike back twice as hard. She looks so cool. <laughs> Are you going to pull? I'm probably skipping, honestly. Yeah, what does Miss Bernice have to do? Ooh. Ooh. Mixer and Shaker are simply too hot to handle. So are you. Mixer and Shaker to fire continuously while using her nimble moves to dodge enemy attacks. If oh, needed, that's cool. Miss Bernice can also concentrate her firepower to unleash blazing from both flamethrowers in a short Oh! Bernice looks so good! It's worth noting that when Bernice builds up enough heat, she enters the nitro fuel cocktail state. Whoa! State, when teammates attack hits an enemy, it triggers afterburn. Doing an extra instance of fire damage. Okay, that actually seems really, really cool. EX special attack to quickly burn enemies while stacking up heat to trigger the nitro fuel cocktail stick. Even if you glorious inferno, her ultimate continues to trigger. So afterburn continues to trigger, so she can apply damage off field. Is that Jane Doe? Oh my god, I have to pull. I have to pull. She works with Jane Doe. That's what they're suggesting. No way. No way. That's crazy. So Bernice works with Jane Doe. <laughs> but this is Bernice we're talking Leaves about. the flame on the field. That's crazy. That's crazy. Sure I have is. to pull. Before she joined the Sons of Caledon, there was a time when Miss Bernice worked alone. Now that I come to think of it, I've always felt like Bernice brings so much energy to everyone around her. Mm -hmm. They're free and unrestrained, like she could burn away all your troubles in one go. With her flamethrowers, yeah, she's the perfect friend. Mm -hmm. <laughs> as long as she never whips you up a meal with Mixer and Shaker. Bernice gang, dude. <laughs> if you're feeling down, just have a Bernie special. You will also go on an adventure with Bernice in the outer Bernice agent story? Let's go. Ooh, ooh, she looks pretty. <laughs> Bernice has also prepared a surprise for you. We'll leave it to you to find out what it is. Okay. As for Caesar, she's the kind of person who just naturally oozes leadership vibes. That's mm -hmm. right. Caesar's pretty reliable 95% of the time. 95% of moment, the time? She always knows how That's to actually pretty high. Come around. Come around? You mean violently? And what about that last 5%? Yeah, if you got fragile stuff that you treasure, like expensive skincare products, you better keep it out of Caesar's reach. No wonder Lucy roasts you every chance she gets. You totally deserve it. <laughs> good roast has to burn. Oh, that's so good. That's <laughs> so good. Of the sons of Caledon get along pretty well. <laughs> of course. But while we're discussing a couple of sons of Caledon members, let's not forget about our comrade in arms, Red Marcus. Oh, Who? That's right. As a member of the Sons Who? of Caledon, you can find Rad Marcus dressed in leather, riding a custom bike into battle. When Rad oh, Marcus it's the Bang Boo! Attack, it oh, how cute! 
steamrolling them. So it's not a new cowboy bamboo. Well, we've covered a lot of content already, but now we're finally. That's a really cool my image. Favorite part. In version one Dude, on the thumbnails, I'm gonna go right to there. Caesar and Bernice <laughs> as their agents from the exclusive channels Amber Crowned Overlord and Born to Burn. <laughs> In the first mm -hmm. half of this version signal search, proxies will be able to obtain the Caesar? S rank agent Caesar and S rank W engine Tusks of Fury. The music Both is so good. I'm just vibing in my chair. Channels. We look forward to working with you, Faithin. And in the second half, Miss Bernice. Her parents in her own Let's search. go. Limited mm -hmm. S -rank I'm pulling for Bernice. Bernice. S -rank w engine She's coming home. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Time to show off your power moves. Let's go. Of course. And as mentioned earlier, mm -hmm. Red Marcus will also be joining us in the new version. All mm -hmm. right. I think it's about mm -hmm. time for us to show the redemption Ooh, codes. Oh, wait. Redemption codes. Let's go. Are you ready? Let's go. A token of our appreciation. Just don't forget to redeem it before it expires. Tour D Inferno. Tour D Inferno. Y'all, I have really enjoyed this special program so far. I have been incredibly, incredibly impressed. I have actually just recently really got more passionately into ZZZ. Since we got Jane Doe and I've had a lot of fun building that team, y'all, the game is so good. And I plan to make ZZZ a much bigger focus of my content moving forward. So I hope to see you there. Apart from the exciting main storyline, there will also Let's be go. many fun events that you won't want to miss in version 1.2. It all started in a diner in the outer ring. Oh? Isn't this Blazewood? Hey, yo. That's right. During the Overlord's Feast event, proxies will take on a commission from the mayor of Blazewood. Who? Revamp an old diner. Working as staff, oh, we'll comfy. handle everything from <laughs> serving guests to cooking in the kitchen. While running New the events? Diner, proxies will learn a lot of interesting stuff about the Outer Ring, including some fun stories about the agents from the Sons of Caledon. Also, as a reward, proxies will get to contract A rank agent Lucy. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> free Lucy. Turn, free Lucy, let's go. Brace yourselves for some classic Lady Lucy sass. <laughs> Next up, a new mini game called Bizarre Brigade will be available at Osha's Arcade. As far as I know, players take on the role of a little traveler in the game and fight off enemies with the friends you meet along the way. That's right. Players can all the friends we meet along the way during the different exploration stages, which will have a huge impact on your fighting style and ability. Let's go. Survive. I hope everybody enjoys oh, the new events. Like be something new every time you play the game. It's also worth mentioning. Ideally, that right? Earning polychromes by completing the event. Oh, is this like a survivor survivor type game? Oh, that's game. really, really cool. Additionally, in the event roaming the ether, proxies will receive a vintage computer terminal from the old civilization that the cunning hair salvaged from Hollow Zero. Nicole Let's go. The cunning hairs mentioned. Nicole mentioned. Dashed inside. Nicole's gifts always keep <laughs> me on my toes. <laughs> I wonder what that info could be. Yeah, who knows? It will be up to the proxies and fairy to find out. Now, let's switch things up and head back to New Eridu for some fun okay. and special activities. Psst. Raidu oh, for you. At the newsstand for you to discover. <laughs> you heard her right, proxies. You'll be able to join the Redo Tours puzzle event at cute. the newsstand. Very, very and cute. unlock different puzzles, which depict some interesting stories about New Eridu. Oh, and you'll also be able to earn polychromes and name cards as rewards for completing the event. Oh, we love it. Speaking oh, we which, love it. One for one convenience store is leading the way in setting up a neighborhood night market, right? Ooh, okay. Yeah. Hey, let's go. Looks like I'm not Lots of new content, y'all. Lots of new suit. stuff. You know it. Anyway, Shaw will work with proxies to bring this market together. If you manage to complete the tasks, then I hope to hear more soon about thank you for quality of life out. updates. Ooh. You know. Besides this casual event, updates to the games of four features in version 1.2. So, Ooh, new combat commissions, we like that. Additionally, there will be some new challenges winning a notorious hunt and expert challenge for proxies to try out in the new Let's version. go. Yeah, and presumably the new was that Jane Doe? Was that Shadow Jane Doe? In this update, Chaos Jazz and Protopunk. Ooh, proxies Chaos Jazz. Them from new stages in routine cleanup. To provide proxies with Dog, I'm so hooked in on Bernice. This is crazy. I'm locked in. I'm so tracks. locked into this game. So you should be able <laughs> to catch your hands on the materials you need in no time. Don't forget, Let's go. We've also got other events lined up waiting for you all to discover. Nushiu defense. Cool. Let's go. 
there'll be some fun new game modes in version 1.2. Let's go. That's right. A brand new game mode, Investigator Training Course, will become available in version 1.2. What is this? This mode offers four different courses where you can get a taste of what it's like to be a hollow investigator. And okay. Learn some basic and practical knowledge about hollow exploration. Hey, Each this is pretty cool. Will offer buffs tailored to different factions, and you will even get to use agents you don't own yet to take on formidable. Ooh, enemies. trial use of Ching Yi and Zuyue. After unlocking the tactical course, you can assign your agents to undergo continuous tactical exercises in simulated hollow environments, earning experience along the way. Yeah, okay. Hey, that's really really though. cool. Now, even newly recruited agents can keep up with the team's progress. Yeah, Meanwhile, dude, that is really helpful. Changes coming to Hollow Zero. We have already lowered the requirements for unlocking Withering Garden in version one. All new mode. No need there to explore no with the monitor Proxies array. By completing the hmm. Stages. Hmm. In version 1.2, we're introducing a new blitz mode to Withering Garden. This mode allows you to dive straight into combat and wreck up your weak hmm. investigation without having to explore the TV board. Is anybody After noticing a fight, trend a of the reduction of the TV board? in Zenless Zone Zero? For those who love a challenge, you can choose different modifiers to crank up the difficulty. I fought her for the first time today and she kicked my butt. For doing so, I got her 10% adult. Mode as well. She was dead. Actually, the harder the challenge, the greater the rewards. Of course. We hope you all find the experience you're looking for and have a blast. Excellent. Let's go. I love this update. <laughs> After the update, Proxis can check in to collect 10 hey, free temple. master tapes and Let's go. Boupons. Awesome. And Boupons as well. Let's go. Probably get the new one. He's got some exclusive intel up his sleeve about some game optimizations that you proxies have been discussing lately. Ooh, so, okay, new game optimizations in Zenless Zone Zero. First, let's take a look at the optimization of the HD <gasps> monitor array. Let's Only find out. TV mode. Did they kill the now, TV mode? For proxies who have already completed and met certain criteria for commissions that include TV mode gameplay, Fairy will help you retrieve auto explore data and rewards from previous attempts. If you're willing to give her some time. In wow. Words, okay. So this is kind of like assignments or dispatches, addition, right? Optimize the TV mode to make everything feel smoother. Some event animations will play faster, and you will be able to skip certain parts. Oh, that is much We've faster. Also adjusted the interactions for some common events, cutting down on the number of close-up scenes. Overall, oh, let's there are go. many improvements to the TV board experience in the new version, and you'll definitely notice the difference. Right now that I'm not binging the story of Zenless Zone Zero, the TV mode isn't so good news bad. Busy, Honestly, Even if you can't log in, you'll still keep I fear that they don't charge. overcorrect. Backup battery charge? You can use all that stamina you've collected. Precisely. Let's go. Oh my goodness, God. This is just a standard quality of life in games. I'm so glad it's here. Oh my goodness. The squad configuration system. <gasps> Finally, pre save teams, dude. Let's go. Into combat with your preset squad right from the deployment. In Amazing. Advance. On top of that, you can also decide whether or not to bring a bamboo into battle. At the same time, Amazing. I was trying to play with my teams to earlier to try out who defense. worked with Ooh, who. So the experience is getting now we'll be able to do that. Better. It'll be good. Heck yeah. <laughs> no need to manually change squads every time. Perfect, right? I've Excellent. Been looking forward to this update for a while. Perfect. But I remember last time someone said something about playing as agents inside the city. So Ooh. How's that all coming along? In version 1.2, no way. Get to explore new Eridu from the perspective of Caesar Wow. And Bernice. Dude, but they got it. All, you'll also be able to switch freely between Wise and Bell. They got Jesus this Christian. fixed up quickly, really very, very quickly. And even though it won't be in the upcoming update, by version 1.4, proxies will be able to explore the city freely as any one of your agents. Okay, by 1.4, that's fair. Proxies complete a certain we understand. The main storyline, starting from version 1.2, you'll be able to advance the clock as you wish. No longer will proxies have to worry about getting stuck due to time during a Oh my goodness, thank God. I hate the time. I hate the time thing. That are all coming along nicely. Hate the time thing. All right. Looks like today's special program is coming to a close. Y'all, it was but really, really good. So I really enjoyed this special program for version 1.2 of Zenless Zone Zero. I cannot wait. I will be playing the new update. I cannot wait. I 
have streamed all of Zenless Zero. I have streamed all of Zenless Zone Zero so far live right here on YouTube. So if you're interested in seeing my reactions to any of the previous story events, please feel free to check it out. I have really enjoyed the game, especially recently since I got Jane Doe and I've started to build that team and I've built my Zoo UN team as well. I have to get Bernice for my Jane Doe team, that off field fire anomaly. It's going to be absolutely amazing. We can ride motorcycles. In this update, that is going to be sick. Got a motorcycle right there. As well as many, many different quality of life updates that proxies have been asking to come to the game. So I am really looking forward to version 1.2. Please be on the lookout for more in Zenless Zone Zero content from me. I will be reacting to all these trailers, playing through this story, and all that good stuff. Okay? If you enjoyed, please consider liking and subscribing, and I hope to see you in the future. Everybody, please take care of yourselves, be good, and bye-bye now. Have fun in Zenless Zone Zero.